morning people it's 8 in the morning and it's already super hot today we are ready to depart from this town of what was it called here Cimitarra. Cimitarra. our bikes are loaded we parked them last night over here and there was a guardian all night long to take care of the bikes we were thinking about having breakfast here at this town but we had some food this morning so we're not really hungry right now so what we're gonna do is we're gonna start driving and when we reach the next town we'll probably stop for uh, for some breakfast what do you say about that yeah perfect Let's here go. we go it will be fun today yeah Okay, oh, I slept so well last night. It was so comfortable that room. There was no noise at all We need it. We needed a good night's sleep It's unbelievable how hot it is here just at 8 in the morning Woo, buddy Look at that snowman made from tires. <laughs> cool. Well, the plan for today is to go all the way to the small town of Florian. It's about 130 kilometers away from here. It's not that far when you think of distance, but I think most of the road is going to be unpaved. So um, it gonna, it's going to take about five hours all the way there. It's going to be a nice adventure. We really want to ride off-road and today it's going to be the first day um, like of a full road off-road because we've been riding off-road but it's been just for a little for little bits but today I think most of the road, I hope I'm not mistaken, I think most of the road will be unpaved. This, this little town of Florian used to be off limits due to guerrilla activity. It is a very secluded place and it is home to one of the most stunning waterfalls I've ever seen online because I haven't been there yet. Um, it is this huge waterfall that drops from the mountain. It starts like from, a, from the mouth of a cave and then it drops all the way into the valley. It's just beautiful. I can't wait to visit that place. I think it is gaining, it is gaining fame now uh, with social media but apart from that it's still a very secluded place so i hope we're gonna get a chance oh we took a wrong turn so i hope we're gonna get a chance at looking and living what the real colombia rural life in colombia is like Google Maps is weird. Apparently, this is not the way either. Lots of speed reducers here. Landa Suri, 28 kilometers. That's the next village we're going through. Uh, it feels much better once you start riding. The cool air starts coming in, you start feeling better. It's not, you don't feel the heat anymore, you know. Watch out, Bukhar. I guess this first part of the road is gonna be paved. It's in pretty good condition. But I'm pretty sure it's not going to be like that the whole way because actually we were looking for the road to go there and Google Maps proposes two different roads but we're not taking any of those. We're going to go through the small villages, uh, through the mountains so I'm pretty sure it's not going to be paved.
I think this car is carrying milk. It's okay? That bike in front of Kaito doesn't even have a license plate. <laughs> uh. Okay, this is the end of the paved road. For now, I guess. I know, there's more paved road right here. <laughs> we left the town behind and now it feels like we're in the middle of a tropical forest. Whoa! Get in there, ooh! Wow, there was water coming down that mountain. Fruit station, they have coconuts, avocados, bananas, mandarins. Look at this, more here. Nice. What in the world happened here? Huge, huge landslide. Buenas. Oh, hey, buddy. Wow. We're so up high. Amazing. <laughs> um, it says stop. Can we go? Let me see. Oh, we need to stop here. Okay. Gracias. Okay, then let us through. Oh, it's gonna be a large road. We might have made it to Landasuri. Oh. Are you hungry or not? Um. I'm okay. It depends. You wanna get something to eat? Okay, let's keep on going. There's gonna be, I guess, like this, um, these little stops along the road where they sell some fruit and stuff. So maybe if we wanna eat something, we can stop at one of those. We're at the main square. It's not even nine in the morning, and everybody's out and moving around and selling food and. The businesses are open. <laughs> Amazing. Ooh, this is where we say bye to the paved road, I guess. Did it rain here last night? Kind of wet. I think it rained here last night. We were not that far away from here, but everything's wet here. Where we slept the night last night, it didn't rain at all. I don't know what's worst, if having this wet road with mud, or having it dry with lots of dust. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think. <laughs> Woo. Ooh. Keep the tire straight. That's what I learned from last time. Keep it straight. <laughs> okay, we've made it to the first part of the mud. <laughs> How old is this kid? He's already riding a motorbike out here. Hola!
Wow, people live out here, man. Kaito took a wrong turn. Here he comes. Welcome back. This is a rough descent. <laughs> and the locals do it like it was nothing. Woo. Hey doggy, you have some balls there, nah. The mules are the experts of the road. Buenas! すごいね、本当に地元の人たちはノーヘルで<笑> ベルゼ。おお、これ右落ちたら大変なことになる。コロンビアのオフロードには3つ、4つぐらいの種類があって、こういったちょっと土、ちょっと石。これが1パターン。2パターン目がもうがっつり岩。3つ目のパターンは
De pronto ya en la panadería le estoy poniendo ya la bajita. ¿sí? De pronto. No oh, allá arriba, allá donde van a hacer la niña también le preparan. Ah, ok. Ahí okay. habrá preparado. ¿eh? Ok, gracias. Ok. Gracias. No. No, en el momento lo estoy haciendo, pero papas. Ah, bueno, vamos a ver qué tiene aquí. Es cuando ah, sí, Gracias. We're going to try some local buñuelos. Apparently, they came just out of the of the oil. They're actually fried, no baked. And this is basically something very traditional in Colombia. It is a cheesy dough. It, it doesn't have like cheese inside, but it is mixed with the dough. And it's like this. And it's something very typical also for Christmas, but you will find it all, all year round. Mm. My first one in years, in years, in years. Gracias. Nami nami desu yo. Nani nami nami nano. Sugoi ne. Chou mai de. Nonde mite. Vegetation here changed completely. It's amazing how fast the weather can change. We were at the valley, it was 26 degrees, very, very hot, and now we're at the top of these mountains. It is chilly, guys. Why not? Little school up here. It's like we're driving in between a canyon. Wow, look at this! That's a big nose ring, you buddy. I'm just trying to keep my tires straight here. A truck going here. It's nuts. Okay. Wow, we came all the way from there. You can see the road on the other side. <laughs> mm, poof, poof, all the smoke. Yes. Everyone says hi with a smile. Little kids walking. Look at that. Buenos dias. Hey buddy. Buenos dias. Oh, sorry buddies. It looks so small next to that huge rock. Amazing. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Well, a paved road. It started raining. Gosh. It's sunny where we're going, but it's somehow cloudy here. Oh, we got to dressed up, I guess. Bien, muy bien, gracias. Some people have dogs as pet, other people have sheep, I guess. Gracias. Chao. ちょっと雨が降ってるけど大丈夫でしょう。レンギア傷にこのまま行きます。すげえ坂これ。雨で石が湿ってるせいでだいぶ滑ります。特にでかい石であればあるほど。さっきからツルンツルン行ってます。雨がひどすぎるんでレインコートやっぱり来ます。これはやばい。I feel like a stuffed potato now. we have so far.
Look at that! Wow! It is completely broken! Yeah, bye! Better get out of here. You don't want to fall with that, that broken road there. Oh, this is such a weird feeling. There's barely, there's barely any mud. Oh, but somehow, but somehow the tire slipped from right or left. All these, all these rocks are super, super slippery. Such a weird feeling. Like, I don't feel my tires are rolling, they're just slipping. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Yeah, the... No, but it's worse.